Hello, my name is Julian Rodriguez, Director of Assessment and Instructional Technology for Chino Valley Unified School District. I put together this little tutorial for those of you who are using um, ARIES gradebook already. And when it comes to grade reporting time, you'll want to be able to just push those grades directly into the report cards. And so in order to do that, we're going to have to make sure that your assignments that you've already entered are mapped to local standards. So once you've logged on to Aries.net, you'll want to select uh, your gradebook. And you'll see here that I have five gradebooks set up. Now I'm going to go ahead and open my reading gradebook. And I want to go in and manage my assignments. So from here, you'll see that I have a number of tabs up here and I'm going to choose my assignments. Um, this is the overall information for my gradebook, and, and since you've already set up your grade books, uh, this should all look pretty familiar with you. Now, if you don't know whether or not you've mapped your assignments to standards, you'll be able to tell right here on this page. As you can see, my very um, assignment number three here, Rosa's book, is mapped, currently mapped, to California Common Core English Language Arts Standards. However, my other assignments are not. So when I go to grade reporting, if I were to push these grades into the grade reporting, the only grade that would be pushed would be this assignment right here. And so we want to make sure that the other assignments make it in. And so from here, I'm going to go ahead and edit my other assignments. Once I've clicked on edit, this information that I've already set up into um, each of these assignments will, will pop up. And down here, I'm going to scroll down and you'll see standards. And I'm going to want to add a standard. You'll notice that if I leave Common Core here, nothing is populated down here. If I select California State standards, nothing is populated. However, if I click on Local, I'll now have a selection. And then I also want to select the grade level for which I'm inputting grades. These standards that are down here are directly aligned to the interim report card that we have in place. And so in order for grades to be entered, I have to map our assignments to those to one of these standards. And so from here, um, the assignment that I'm currently working on, let's say was mapped to um, California Common Core English Language Arts, and I can go ahead and add that. And once I select this, it will be populated up here. If I wanted to get a little bit more detailed, I could go ahead and click on this area over here. And then I could add a concentration. Once I've populated the standards that need to be there, I click OK. And down here, you'll see the standards listed. If I go ahead and save and close, on the refresh, you'll see that I now have my second assignment that is mapped to standards. And I want to do this for each of the assignments that I would like to be included into the grade reporting. I hope you found this tutorial helpful. From here, you'll want to reference the document on the Information Services website that shows you um, a tutorial on how to um, load grades directly from a gradebook. If you have any questions, please feel free to give me a call at extension 1640. Thank you. Have a great day.